Hey there, Virgo. I'm professional psychic Karen Marie, and this is your reading for January 23rd through the 29th, 2023. So I've drawn several cards here. I have a recent past card, which is the aloneness card. This card is about the spiritual search, when you're seeking out your connection to the divine. So this tells me that you've probably been chanting or meditating or praying or actively searching or seeking out wisdom and guidance from a spiritual place. The aloneness card also can say that maybe you've needed to pull away from people just to have some time alone. It's been too peopley out there that you've just needed to be with you recently. The card that represents you right now is the lover's card. At the core, this is a love for yourself, like inner child, but you can feel divine love for yourself. You can feel some compassion for yourself. This card is the classic card that indicates lovers coming together. So you could be experiencing that in your life right now. You experience the bliss, the heart connection with someone else that you love. You could also be putting out there the desire for this connection in a way that's so powerful that you are manifesting. You are setting the cause to have this come into your life. I've drawn two cards for this week for you. The first card is the isolation card, which can indicate that you're feeling shut down, that you may have old feelings coming up. This person looks like they're crying. Um, so you could be having some feelings getting stirred up. It feels like it's old gunk that is just coming out for release, in which case climb into a tub or a shower, take a walk, journal, talk to someone to let the feelings up and out. The quicker you just be with your feelings and let it ride out, the quicker it moves through you. When you shut down and block it and repress it, then it implodes. So my advice would be to let the feelings flow. It could also indicate that someone is icing you out, in which case go back to spiritual practices and connect with the divine, which never leaves you alone. I've also drawn the creativity card. So this is a call to creative projects, writing, doing music, dancing, whatever way your creativity shows up for you in your life, it feels like it could really feel healing to do some of the work. Again, journaling, writing out what's going on, writing a song about what's going on, creating a beautiful piece of art, even gardening or cooking could be creative energies. But it feels like you're going to feel inspired to do something on a creative front front, even getting creative ideas about something that feels more mundane, even if it's like housework, maybe a creative approach to doing that. Maybe it's putting on music and dancing as you clean the house. That'll work for you this week. Whatever you're doing this week, Virgo, have a great week. And if you want to check out what the transits are for the week, I've got the link to that video below. Peace.